Hey guys, welcome to today's episode of Horse Creek Cemetery Investigation. Me, John, and Bill uh, have been fascinated with this place for a long time. I've had several Bigfoot reports here, several ghost reports here, and something is definitely hanging around here. Uh, we had a lot of reports from genealogists about just mysterious things that have happened here and I want to read you some of what I've got so far and then we will start investigating. Horse Creek Cemetery is very remote. Uh, it takes about 35 minutes to get there on a the dirt road and then another 15 to actually get to the cemetery. You can drive right up to it and it's uh, fairly open, very remote, and a lot of legends are in this place. One of the weirdest and scariest that we, we heard was there was a goat woman for a long time that haunted this place. Yes, a goat, a goat, goat woman. Very unusual to say the least. Another thing that Bill found uh, was Miss... Adele Moore, uh, baby, baby girl, was buried in this cemetery. And one of the inscriptions on one of the graves are safe in the arms of Jesus. Now, safe from what, you ask? One of the oddest accounts we heard about the goat woman is that she would come up here and dig up graves. Now many people in the community did a lot of stuff to keep her from doing this and we think that's why the little graves at the front have houses built around them. Now this grave here is the owner of the cemetery. The guy that actually gave the land for the cemetery to be made. And what's odd is no one knows where his wife is buried in this cemetery. So, is she the goat woman? Is she what haunts the cemetery? I guess we're going to find this out tonight. So get ready, listen close, and you will see some stuff in this video. We capture some good things, and you guys may see some things also. Join us as we investigate Horse Creek Cemetery even more. Hey guys, I hope everybody is well. It's kind of what I say every time I start. I'm here with John. Y'all know John from last time, and Bill's over here behind the camera. We are at Horse Creek Cemetery, and uh, as you've seen at the front, uh, there's a, we've got a lot of reports here. And one thing that we uh, kind of have experienced is Bigfoot and the paranormal, and we're gonna we're gonna mix them. Now we're still gonna do Bigfoot. Right. Absolutely. Absolutely. We're still going to do the paranormal and uh, anything else. So, John, talk about what you got today. We got some good stuff. Well, um, we got a, a PSB7 spirit box with an orbital speaker. Going to be using this, and this will really hopefully um, enhance the audio um, so we can hopefully get some really good stuff on camera. Jonathan's also going to be running a digital recorder next to this to hopefully pick up some stuff. I know our last video got tons of things that we didn't hear while we were out here and you guys on the other side just really did a great job of pointing that out and we I tell you what we appreciate that because I went back and actually looked at it myself got an EVP meter 
I mean, no, excuse me, an <laughs> EMF meter right here um, that, te that detects any kind of energy, um, magnetic or otherwise, and uh, going to be using that. And we got some other stuff over there that we'll be introducing through the night, but uh, these are the main two things that we're going to be uh, using. I've got an EMF meter right here. Can you make these lights move if you're with us? Can you do something to make this move? Can you speak into that box for us? Mr. Moore, I know you don't understand what this is. Can you, uh, can you make these little uh, lights light up? Mr. Moore, what happened to your wife? Ask him his name. First name? Ask him his name. What's your first name, Mr. Moore? Who are you? Can you talk to us? All right, Mr. Moore, these are reporters that will tell me if you say anything. Is that light messing it up? I'll try again. I was just getting a weed or two out of the way. Is it messing this up? It's not, it's not affecting the bars, no. Okay, good. Okay, let's see hmm? I just got the mouth shine right out there. Straight over the stone? Uh, no, it's the wood.
Now at this point, Bill started doing a roll call of everybody in the cemetery in an attempt to, put, to pick up some EVPs. And while John was filming, he picked up something pretty, pretty freaky. All right, Miss Lena, can you do anything? Johnny, you trying to communicate with Jonathan? Uh -huh. Come on, Miss Lena. Can you do anything with this light, Miss Lena? Is there anything here? I guess y'all don't want to talk, do you? You're bashful. How about you, Miss Bun, right there? Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. behind me I started getting a crazy crazy noise in the woods so I got out my thermal and actually caught something yet it didn't have a heat signature but it was also very odd alrighty guys I'm looking at that little shape right there where the red thing is it's talking to Bill and the camera just went off by itself And Jonathan, I was already looking in that direction because I thought I heard some stirring down there in the hollow. Oh, that's cool. Come on, what's up with my camera? Come on, focus. Focus, camera, come on. There we go. It hadn't moved, so who knows. So right after this, I uh, walked back to my chair and sit down and was just resting for a little bit. And I started hearing a steering from one of the little houses. And, well, I'll just let the video tell the story. I'm right here with Josh Lincoln. You make it go cold right here. Okay, I see your hair stringy. You're not as pretty as uh, you probably once were. Can you make that spirit box over there talk to us? Yeah, you can move now. Can you 
touch my coat or something? Touch my jacket, do something. Is that you? I hear screaming and sobbing. I hear screams and sobs. Okay, we just, uh, on that thermal, we, you, you can see a shape of a head of a woman. Now, you see this right here. There is nothing there. Everybody see that? Right. Okay, when you come back here and you put the thermal on, that shape, see, you see nothing there. But that shape in the thermal is inside there. It's showing up in the thermal. Okay, I'm going to get the thermal back out. 23 year old Leda Bun Atkinson. But look at here, she's back. See that, John? Yeah, I do. See that head right there? Looks like she's got long stringy hair. It looks like she's there. Like she see that right there? See that see it? Mm-hmm. Now if you don't mind, will you turn a light on right over there? Okay. Now you see people that there is nothing there. Nothing at all. But on the thermal Look at there. That's a woman's head. It's like stringy hair right there. Now we started uh, trying to debunk this and, and, and couldn't. There was nothing there except it showed up on thermal. So when I got home, I uh, took a picture, uh, took the picture off the thermal, and I put it into uh, another program that made it uh, infrared instead of thermal. And the figure was still there. Alrighty, guys, we're uh, we're back at Horse Creek. Uh, we went down to the bottom to check out where the guy drowned and. Uh, look for the big man and so we're just gonna leave in a second uh we're gonna try a spirit box session and then we're gonna uh we're gonna get out of here right. go ahead john it's gonna be loud right off go right ahead buddy i put my hand over it to muffle while i ask so you can all right now we're fixing to leave is there anything you want to say Anything you wish to speak to us? With this, we're going to try this. See if it's got anything, any kind of words it wants us to communicate with. All right, guys, we're fixing to leave. If you are here, can you move this meter or speak into this box? Could you spot the door? I just thought I heard a chest bump. I did it too. Can you speak to us? 
Where's your wife buried? I didn't like that. Is she an idiot? Your wife? Was she no good? Is that why you didn't give her a, a headstone? Your daughter. Did she do something to your daughter? Did she abuse your daughter? Did the old bitty abuse your daughter? I'd be mad too. Somebody's coming. Somebody's coming. We got people. Yeah, hey, Bill, fade out to the back. There's two somebodies. Just fade off in the back. Come on. All right. I'm turning this off. Yeah. Well, they just driving right up. They won't see Bill though. They will now. Teenagers. Oh, yeah, they seen Bill. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not trying to run. run. It's always great to have one in the back. Are you still recording? Yeah. All right, let's wrap up. Come on, come on. Okay. All right, guys, we've got a good investigation. we got people driving. Up, yeah, so we're going we're gonna to wrap up in just a second. So. Yeah.